the real danger to people with disabilities uh, now is this doctor assisted suicide, assisted suicide, physician assisted suicide, medical aid, or whatever you want to call it. That is what presents a danger to disabled people and other marginalized communities. Your organization, Not Dead Yet, is currently a plaintiff in a case in California involving what you just mentioned. Why? And what's your argument? Our argument is that uh, assisted suicide, in this case, it's like to say in California, so it's referring to California case, but I certainly feel it in a global uh, way that assisted suicide is, uh, laws violate the Americans with Disabilities Act uh, because it sets up a two-tiered system. It's inherently discriminatory. For people that aren't familiar with the language of the text, can you just explain what you mean? So assisted suicide is supposed to be for people who are terminal with six months or less to live. Doctors often make mistakes about that. Then what ends up happening is you get your terminal diagnosis. Remember, terminal people are a subset of the disability community. You know what I mean? So people with terminal conditions who even themselves may not consider themselves disabled are protected under the Americans with Disabilities Act. Because usually when you're terminal, you know, you are needing help you know, with three or more uh, activities of daily living. And so they're protected. Um, the, there was a, a study in 2021, a Harvard study, uh, a survey, if you will, that showed uh, that about 82% of the doctors that they surveyed felt that people with disabilities had a uh, a lower quality of life or lesser quality of life than non-disabled people. And so what happens is you combine that with the doctor's biases, disability discrimination that happens, a doctor is gonna be more um, uh, apt to write you out or maybe even try to convince you that this is a good thing. Because if you're given a terminal diagnosis, it's gonna be normal to be depressed. And so what do you do? You get mental health treatment. You know, uh, people with disabilities, we already have, you know, limited access to that. And then when you when you rationalize this, you know, people think, oh, well, it's normal that you would be depressed because of your disability. People, we have this better dead than disabled uh, faith 